G'day, I'm Drew from Gringo Productions, and today we're going to look at how to use the curves in DaVinci Resolve. So I've got our clip here, which is our Alexa footage, it has a basic grade on it, some saturation and contrast. And now let's say we wanted to add some more contrast using the curves. By default, they're all ganged together. So let's say we move this down, and then we move this up. So we have more saturation in our image, and we have a lot more contrast. What if we would do that by just using the Y? And Y stands for luminance, so that means we're just controlling the light, we're not controlling RGB, so we're not controlling the color. So if we bring it down here, and then we come up here, so this is our image just with the Y selected, not ganged together, and this is our other image with all the colors selected together. As you can see, our image is a lot more saturated, all the colors are really popping out compared to our image here. So let's do that again, and this time I'm going to show you on the vector scope of what it's actually doing. So we come across to our scopes. So just make it bigger by clicking this little button here. So here we have a vector scope, right? And if we bring in the curve, looking at a vector scope and looking at this image, you can see how much saturation it's adding to your image. And if we do that again, just with the Y value, as you can see, we're not actually adding any saturation. All we're doing is adding contrast to our image. So when would you use Y and when would you use the colors? Let's say you have your image here. It's really saturated, really high contrast. So let's make a new node, Alt S. Your client's like, maybe let's add even more contrast to it. If we're doing the gang again, we know we're going to get a really saturated image. So we come across to our Y and by not adding any more saturation, we're still getting that nice contrast. Your client can be like, that's exactly what I wanted. I didn't want any more saturation. I just wanted contrast. It looks terrible. That's exactly what I was going for. You get your money, they're happy and everyone walks away. So in a future video, we are going to dive into the complexities of the curve, mainly how to use this area and this area here. This one's quite interesting, so that'll be a good video to make. If you have any comments or grades you'd like to see, please leave a comment below and I'll see if I can emulate the grades you want or any style you would like to see more of. So I've been Drew from Gringo Productions. Have a great day and thanks for watching.